Hello guys, welcome to this short tutorial on how to make submissions and test your code on the Replit platform for our DSA contest. We provide you with three language options, Java, Python and C++. You can write your code in either of these languages, test your code using the predefined test cases and submit your code for evaluation. Now let's see how to write and test your code on the platform. We'll take an example of Java language. When you click on the link that has been shared with you in a browser, it will open in a browser and you will see a screen that somewhat looks like this. You will have uh, all the questions over here and all the language options C++, Java and Python. We will go ahead with the Java thing. On opening the Java uh, question, you will see a screen that looks like this. It has two files, the readme file and the main.java file. In case of Python, it will be main.py and in case of C++, it will be main.cpp but the basic uh, function of all these three files is same. This preview of the readme file provides you with the input state problem statement, input and output formats and the constraints for the problems. So you can take a look over here and get to know what the problem actually says. Then this main.java file it contains some basic starter code and space for you to write your own code and uh, make the submission. So let's go ahead with this demo problem which says take an input string from the user and print it to the output. Okay, so this is your free canvas. You can do anything over here. You can import whatever library you need. So we'll use And then Once you think your code is ready and done and you want to test it, you have two options. Either you can go over here and run the predefined tests. As you can see the test case has passed or you can even give your own input and then uh, check your code for manual testing. So here. I give the input 1 and I get back 1 which means my code is working alright. So these are the two ways in which you can test your code. Similarly for the C++ and the Python files they have the same structure so you just need to open it go to the main file read the question over here write your code in the main file and then go over to the test cases and run those tests. As you can see the test cases have failed as of now because we haven't written any code over here. And Lastly let's take a look at the python file as well. So this is the canvas to write the code the problem statement and input and output format over here and then test your case either automatically using the predefined test cases or you can run the code and enter your own test cases to see whether your code is working fine or not. So that's it for this short tutorial. If you have any other questions reach out to us on our discord platform. Thank you.